during work hours, this particular kind of music was played. There was a music belt to, to, to support workers. Yes, again, it was Nkrumah's vision of making sure that the, the Ghanaian believed in his own person. Mm -hmm. And if you may remember, on Independence Day, when he was declaring Ghana's independence, he made a very powerful statement who said, we will live as long as man lives on mm earth. -hmm. He made three powerful statements. One, that Ghana is free forever. Yes. Mm -hmm. That the independence of Ghana was mm -hmm. meaningless unless it was linked with the mm -hmm. total liberation of Africa. Yeah. And that the black man is capable of running his own affairs. Right. And also the African personality mm -hmm. message. Mm -hmm. He wanted us to be to believe in ourselves. And this is something that we seem to be losing mm -hmm. as we grow older and older. Okay. Ghana is sixty years old. Mm -hmm. And I don't I don't think we have really understood the capacity of the African personality mm -hmm. issue that I was raising right. sixty years ago. Mm -hmm. I call you senior. Now, at this time, um, if you look at Nkrumah's vision and how Ghana was positioned, how broadcasting was also positioned to carry government to the people, people to the government, is the media fulfilling? Are we on track? Well, I wouldn't say we're not on, we are on track, but we need to do a lot more to develop and improve the quality of the media in the country. I think the media has become too partisan. Uh, every every almost every newspaper believes in a certain political agenda, mm -hmm. and they tend not to concentrate on being uh, objective. Right. But they, whatever is written is slanted towards promoting the agenda of a political party, mm -hmm. and that's where we lose it. I think journalism has improved. We come and set up the school of journalism mm -hmm. and, and all that. But I think we need to specialize in certain areas. Uh, I was on another station not too long ago, and I was saying that it seems like we have not the, the media mm -hmm. and the journalists have not specialized in various areas. I mean, everybody seems to be doing the same thing. You tune into a radio station or a TV station, mm -hmm. and the discussion is between two political groups: NBC mm -hmm. and. Mm -hmm. And they don't tend to create room for people with authentic and authority to come and discuss the issues. So the a subject comes up, it's water. Right. And the one two people on the radio mm -hmm. or on the T V station mm -hmm. and they'll be selling the agenda of a political party and leaving the subject matter mm -hmm. itself free. Okay. I think this is where we are feeling. Mm -hmm. I think journalists should specialize in various areas mm -hmm. and, and also pro, uh, producers should invite people who understand the issues. On one panel of a discussion, mm -hmm. two people, one is a doctor, mm -hmm. one is an engineer, they'll be t discussing medical science mm -hmm. and they become authority of medical science. Okay. General secretaries. Yes. <laughs> you talk about road construction mm -hmm. and the same two people become authority mm -hmm on road construction, you talk about any any other subject and two people who perhaps they understand the issue but they are not authority of, of, there. of the subject. Okay. So if the journalist can specialize so that you can then direct and send the message across and, 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 and create the discussion effectively, it will be better. Okay. For a